This video shows how to assemble our spiral marble run. All the cutting files for this series of marble runs will be available to download for free on our website, freelaserfiles.com. This run is one in the series which fit onto our modular marble run base. The spiral run shown in this assembly is made entirely of 3mm medium density fiberboard MDF, but any suitable 3mm or 1 8 inch thick material could be used. Any of our manual or powered lifts can be used with this run. All the modules in this series are designed to use half inch or 12.7 millimeter balls. Start your assembly using parts numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. These parts will make the spiral. Note that the parts are marked with the letters A, B, C, and D. Insert the slot marked A on part number 1 into the slot above the A on part number 2. The opposing slots marked C can now be inserted. Work the spiral into the slots on the uprights. Your spiral may be quite springy, so you will need to work from side to side to get the coils into the slots. There are score lines inside the coil to help you align it correctly to the uprights. Part number 3, marked with letter C, can now go in place. Insert the long tab into the lower slot of part number 2, and then the upper slot into the spiral. Work the spiral into the slots on the upright. Repeat this with the final upright. Again check the alignment of the spiral to the uprights. Part number 5 can now be glued into place, matching the marked slots to the corresponding tabs. Double check that the spiral is into all the slots. Run a bead of glue into all the joints of the spiral and the uprights.
This should be set aside to dry. Next you need parts 14 and 15. And the four parts, number 16. Clamps will be used to hold these parts. Clamp this, and set it aside to dry. The sides of the run are assembled next from parts, 10, 11, 12, and 13. Again clamps will be used to secure the parts. Note the split tab and split slot which ensures the parts go together correctly. The score design needs to face up. Check that the parts are held square. Parts numbers 6, 7, 8, and 9 can be attached to the spiral. Lay out the parts as shown. The small tabs on part 6 and 7 should face towards you. The split slots on part number 8 need to be on the right. Apply glue to the tabs on the spiral uprights and assemble the frame as shown.
Use two rubber bands to hold these pieces in place. You can now add the two sides which were assembled earlier. This can be left to dry. The two parts number 17 and the two numbered 18 will make the ball in feed. Part number 20 is added to the top of the rear upright. Check that these pieces are square. The ball out feed, assembled earlier, can now be attached to the frame. Remove the two rubber bands. Glue the outfeed in place on the frame as shown. The final piece to be added is part number 19. This support adds extra strength to the top of the spiral. Your run is now complete and can be slotted onto the modular base which was assembled in an earlier video. The run can be fed from any of our manual or powered lifts. 
please let us know in the comments if you would like us to design more lifts and runs to fit this base. We hope that you will subscribe to our YouTube channel to enable us to keep producing free laser files.